Now that we have passed 5,000 subscribers, there is a brand new giveaway. At 6,000 subscribers, I'm going to be giving away 1,500 credits that three people can win. So each person gets 500 credits just to themselves. If you would like to enter this giveaway, make sure to like, subscribe and notifications and comment your gamer tag along with your platform down in the comments. Good luck to everybody that enters and without further ado, let's get into the video. Just before we do get into the video, I'd love to give a quick shout out to the brand new sponsors on the channel, AOA.com. AOA is a reliable website that sells Rocket League items in exchange for money at the lowest prices and the fastest delivery speeds. Make sure to check them out through the top link in the description and use code TXC for 6% off on every purchase that you make. Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be taking a look at the most viral Rocket League TikToks I can find and reacting to them. Some of them also involved in-game features, so I also had to test them out for myself. But I really hope you guys do enjoy. Before we do go into the clips, please do make sure to like, sub, and notifications. That would be greatly appreciated. But anyway, without any more further ado, let's get into today's video. Okay, so this is the first TikTok we're going to be reacting to, and let's see what this guy does. He hits the ball over there, jumps on the post, jumps off the post, and then he has, like, infinite boost. Okay, I have actually seen this before, and I can confirm this is fake. This is basically back as mob where you can go into any training, and then you can actually turn on something which gives you unlimited jumps or boosts or whatever you want to call it. But, yeah, this guy is definitely faking this. Okay, but anyway, this second TikTok right now, how to get out of the Aqua Dome map. I have actually seen this before, and I know it is true, but what I'm going to do after this clip has played, I'm going to hop into Rocket League and show you guys this in action. So, yeah, you can basically fly around this map. You can see all, like, the sharks. You can see the whale, and it's actually insane. And I believe that you can go above, like, the water, and it's really cool. So what I'm going to do is hop on Rocket League in just a second and show you guys how this actually works works and the code. Okay, so I've just hopped onto Rocket League and I've already got the map favorited. So let me go over to it. What you need to do is go to training, go along to custom, and I've got it favorited. But you guys can see the code on the right side of the screen. But we're going to hop straight into this Aquadome map. And here we are. We are in the map right now. I've got a different car on as well. Like, don't question it. I'm just recording a bit late. Uh, but yeah, this is the map right now. I'm trying to go up a little bit. We're quite low right now. Uh, okay, we're banging into things. Right, we should be going up now. Okay, you guys see that stingray? We got massive shark right there. What I'm going to do, I'm bumping into a load of things. I'm going to try and go up quite a bit. You, you have got the map down there. We've got another shark up there. What I'm going to do is respawn and then start flying up. Hopefully this works. I don't want to spawn in the map. I want to stay outside. Okay, so there is the whale up here. What we're going to do is make our way over to the whale okay so the whale might actually teleport i don't think i'm even catching up to it now i think it might teleport if it does teleport i'm probably gonna have to restart like trying to catch up to it oh wait no we are actually catching up we um, oh it literally just teleported it's over the other side of the map okay right i'm gonna try and make it back over to the whale okay we're almost at the whale i think it's about to turn as well but we're literally right here it's actually kind of hard to tell like how far we are away but we're right here okay right we actually need to turn I think the whale's turning as well. I can't even... Right, I need to get it in shot. Here we go. The whale is right here. We're literally on its tail. Ah, oh, it's swimming faster than us. I can't actually keep up with this. No, that's really annoying. But the whale is right there. I've, oh, I've actually banged into a wall. I won't be able to catch up to the whale, I don't think. Yeah, that's not going to happen. But what we're going to do is we're actually going to swim above this water up here. Because I heard it looks really cool if you do go above this water. Kind of looks like the sky, but it is actually a body of water. So what we're going to do is go up here real quick. And I'll cut to when I'm a little bit closer. Okay, so we're almost here. And it is so bright right now. But we're going to go above. Hold on. I'm kind of struggling to turn right here. Okay, we're literally right here. We're about to go above. What is it going to look like? Oh my god, it's completely black. We look down, and you can see the map down there. You can also see the whale. But this just looks really cool, and you guys really want to try out these maps. Like, there's loads of other ones that are out of map. This isn't the only one that you can just go, like, out of the actual, like, uh, arena. So what we're going to do is fly down real quick. I couldn't catch up with the whale, unfortunately. But we are going to go down to the map. I could actually just respawn. Yeah, it's going to be a lot easier, right? We're going to hit respawn, and here we are, right by the map. And you can also go inside of it if you just, like, go near it, if that makes sense. But anyway, let's move on to the next TikTok. 
Okay, so up next, we got a bit of a freestyle montage sort of thing. And this guy gets a flip reset and then a double tab. That was very nice. I definitely can't do that. A really clean air dribble over a defender right there. And let's see what this guy does. Nobody gets a redirect. Oh, that was actually so clean. Redirects are really nice to see. They're so clean. And I'm guessing this guy gets one as well. Yeah, another redirect from that guy. And then for the last clip, what have we got? I'm guessing it's going to be another redirect once again. Yeah, it is. That was insane. Okay, so those clips were absolutely insane. I didn't really have enough time to like talk over it because it was a really fast paced montage, but they were really nice. We got three little redirects out of the end, which were insane. I definitely can't get anywhere near to that sort of skill. But yeah, that was absolutely insane. The problem was there was a little bit of copyright music all the way through that clip. So I had to get rid of that and add like a little bit of my music on my own. And also the clip might have been a little bit blurry. TikToks are quite small. So I had to like, and I had to kind of like cut it down or just show it in a way that was like clear as I could get it. So hopefully Hopefully that was all right, but anyway, let's get into the next TikTok. Okay, so on next we have Best Bennett Design. Personally, I don't really use Bennett, but we're going to have a look at this anyway. We have a Fire Design. That is so clean. Like, I don't use Bennett, but I would definitely use that design. Up next, we got like a white Bennett with the old Fondant Reward wheels. They look really nice as well. Up next, we got a Rocket Park Detail Scribe Bennett and a pretty short sure Scribe Promo. So, a bit of a cheap design right there. And oh god, that looks so cool. I'm not so sure about that one. Up next, we got what appears to be some weird Rocket League glitch, but I can confirm this is a result of Bacchus mod. There's basically a feature where you can put like this blanket sort of thing on your car, and it does look really cool. My friend Mulchman actually did a video about this, and yeah, it's definitely not a glitch, but it does also look really cool, and other players won't be able to see this. But that is also a nice feature into Bacchus mod. Okay, so this TikTok I've actually already seen, but I just want to put it in here to clear it up. You can't get codes apart from Popcorn. That's the only working one right Right now this guy actually says that there's a code that you can get all those items from obviously it's fake because like there were season rewards in there which are literally limited to every account if you play the game and get those season rewards so that was definitely fake like there's loads of fake tiktok videos saying like enter this code and you can get free items they don't work the only working one is popcorn right now they actually disabled our nitro which isn't great to be honest there's only one code in the game right now they might release more in the future but that's the only one that we know of right now so the last TikTok that I'm going to be reacting to is from an RLCS event where the ball was kept up at zero seconds and the goal that was scored literally changed the outcome of the entire event. So you guys can see in the background right here, yeah, the ball is just being kept up and the goal that was scored was absolutely insane. The angle was crazy. You guys are about to see it and there you go. Justin jumps up and smashes it into the goal. That was absolutely crazy. The whole audience goes crazy. And yeah, it's just a really good clip. And it is literally famous in Rocket League. But anyway, guys, that is going to be it for this video. I really hope you have enjoyed. And if you have, please make sure to like, subscribe, and notifications if you haven't already. And also drop a comment telling me if I should do an another one of these TikTok videos. So I really did enjoy it. I'll probably struggle to find quite a few clips. But yeah, I definitely did enjoy this. And I hope you guys did too. But anyway, guys, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.